and start Grace's. Hello, Vinny. Oh, hi. Hi, so I'm so sorry, you weren't waiting long, were you? No, not too long. So, Vinny, am I at your first digital date in this new normal we're living through? Put me under the spotlight already. That's a tough question to open up with. Um... It's hard. Just would think it would be like, yeah, no. Uh, no, uh, you're not, I'll be honest. OK, well, you can teach me the ropes then, digital Casanova. Oh, listen, I, I, I got this. I think I'm getting the hang of it all and... OK. I kind of... <laughs> OK. <laughs> so, on your profile, it said your industry was other. I was just wondering what you do. Yeah, I'm in corporate law. Um, wow, OK. A little bit shocked that they didn't have a litigation option. I'll, I'll send them some feedback. Sure. I'm a little bit extra like that. So, um, I mean, I presume you've been busy during lockdown. Yeah, apparently the world never stops needing legal advice. Um, I've just been made partner at my firm. So it's a whole new step up trying to make relationships with the clients and video calls are just no way to do it. You're a partner already. That's, that's pretty amazing considering you're only 27. Yeah, it's not very polite to remind a woman of her age. I, I'm so... Uh... I'm so sorry, I didn't mean it. It was nothing about your age, it was more I'm just only, about that you're... I'm only putting on your leg. You are a little bit younger than what I would normally go for, though. Really? Hmm. I guess, why did you go for me, then? I just figured lockdown was a better time than ever to try something new. Well, listen, thank you for fitting something new into your schedule. Of course. Oh, sorry, can I take this? It, it won't take long. What is it? What is it, like a business call or something? Yeah, it's, it's work, I mean... I don't know how important it is, but... Okay. Oh, listen, be my guest, please. Yeah? It'll be two seconds. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hi, Grace here. No, 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 no. They can't get... They can't get cold feet about the merger now. No, no, I know, I know, but it's too late. Legally, they can't. Now, just... Just, just tell them to stop dilly-dallying, okay? And, and I'll get involved if they keep delaying, all right? Yeah. OK, well, just ring me if there's anything else going on, OK? OK. I want a date. Shh, shh. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. That's... Sorry about that. That's fine. Work. It's chaos. That's cool. <laughs> I'd really like to know how come you're single. Your guess is as good as mine. I'm going to fall back on that old cliché that I haven't met the right person yet. What about you? No, no listen. Clichés are often true. Right? I'm a big defender of clichés. Anyway, stop avoiding the question. OK. <laughs> Tell me the answer. What's your relationship history? OK. You can be honest. Again, I'm picking yeah. all. Well, I, listen, I've been single for a while. OK, if I'm honest, I haven't actually been in anything meaningful for a long time. Interesting. So are you looking for something meaningful on here? What, what exactly are you looking for? Again, I'm going to pick oh, all real answers. That's a answers. big question. That is a big question. It's a big question. It's an important question. No, I know. So you're always hoping that the other person is on the same page, but I'm, I'm, I'm looking to be in a relationship, yeah. I mean, these days I'm pretty set on that, and when I meet the right women, yeah, I'm just programmed that way, I guess. OK, I'm the same. I just don't bother wasting my time on things I'm not serious about. Okay, good. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad that we... We're on the, the same, same page. Story. Yeah, 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 completely. Okay. So, Vinny, sorry, my schedule is just a little bit crazy at the moment and um, I kind of need to go soon. Oh. Is there anything else you fancy asking me? Oh, that's such a shame. Um, okay. You've got my full attention, though, for a few more minutes. So think wisely. Okay. Any burning questions? Maybe just tell me a bit more about your upbringing and how you got to be such a high achiever. Oh, don't flatter me. <laughs> um, there's nothing to tell, really. I was really lucky to go to a good school, girls' school. Nice. Got really good grades, did ballet, did lacrosse for my county. I still keep those up casually. That's pretty impressive, I have to admit. Thank you. Um, I just have the most amazing family. My parents are just so brilliant in their own ways. They're my idols, really, and they just have this amazingly strong love. 
Hey, listen, it sounds like they really got it down. They are amazing. And um, what about you? Are you all close with your family? Oh, uh, in simple terms? Yeah, simple's always best, I think. Just be honest. Not um, really. Is this, is this a, too much of a personal question? No, no, not at all. Okay, I'm going to say no. It, it's just complicated. Oh? Yeah, let, let's just say that my, my family life has just never been perfect. I've, I've kind of had to make my own way in life, so. Okay. Sounds, that sounds tricky. Well, I'm going to go now. Sorry if I was a bit outspoken. That's just me. No, it's, just, it's cool. It's just, I really know who I am and what I want, and I just don't want to waste my time, you know? I understand. It's it's better to, you know, get that stuff out in the open. So, you know, being honest is always the best. Wouldn't be anything else. Well, that was a really nice chat. Thank you. Yeah, you too, Grace. Bye. See you later. <clears throat> Again, for all these episodes, I'm going to be picking what I would choose and actual things to do with my real life. So my answers are probably not going to be the same as most people's or some people's, but I hope you still enjoy. Maybe. We'll see.